Hello everyone, welcome back to Hermione Reads Comics. I'm Hermione and I read comics. So in today's video, <clears throat> we're going to do a review of X-Men from the Ashes Infinity Comics this year's edition, <clears throat> which is number one. And please pardon me um, about clearing my throat several times during the course of this video because my... <coughs> oh man, I had a, I had a really bad night as far as coughing is concerned. Um, so I'm going to just uh, get rid of this and let you... All right. So you can't see the, the cover of it. Uh, it's not... So basically this is not like your traditional comic where you can use your finger and do this. It's like this. So that is what the cover looks like. And um, I'll show you what I mean by it being like that. All right, so um, yeah, so it starts off with this guy who is walking around in the snow. Like, it's cold. It's cold out. And... I don't know if this is Scott or someone else. It, it, it's probably not Scott because he doesn't have the uh, glasses on. Um, and then we get then we go back to like you have Scott and Jean who are trying to enjoy um, this romantic night together and stuff. And the, what's going on with Jean is she's going out into space with the Phoenix Force to kind of make some kind of agreement or like see where things are going. That's what she says. Um, and she gets kind of like ticked off with him. He does several things in this issue that she just doesn't like. And yeah, it's, it's, it's insanity. And Basically, this issue is all about, you know, Scott and Jean's last night together and about basically uh, her, her going away. And she does vanish in this issue and Scott has no idea where she's at. And so she he's kind of like on this track. And he looks like, he just looks like a walking skeleton. He is so emaciated. Uh, this guy is, you really do feel, like, bad for him. Um, <laughs> there is, like, blood, and it's like, oh my god. Um, and then, like, Scott leaves to get, uh, to get, um, to get more ice and stuff. So, yeah. Um, so, overall, what did I think about this comic? So, it was really great is I got to read issue number one, which, um, I have no idea even, like, it, it, it got published, um, yesterday, it was published yesterday, which, um, I think is really cool that, you know, I got to read a comic that got published yesterday, um, and everything so it kind of sets everything so that I feel like this comic book kind of sets certain things up not everything up in the series and I'm like okay what happened to Jean did she and Phoenix decide to leave early what not I I don't know uh, so I was not uh, I was not going to read it because it does the scroll thing and I'm not really a fan of the scroll thing I think you should do the, that kind of thing, um, like a regular comic. But I do understand that that is an op. That s some comics they do have the, you know, the scrolling, and then they have like the book, which you know, if you want to go that route, that's great. But I prefer the book thing. <laughs> I'm using thing a lot in this video. Um, so I am going to give it five stars for right now. <laughs> We'll see what issue two brings when it does come out, uh, which uh, everyone knows due to 
uh, how long it takes for the next issue to pop up on the app, it'll probably be, uh, it'll probably be three months from now, or three months from next month, or when the next, next issue comes out. So, uh, I, what I'll actually do is I will actually go ahead and buy it on Kindle, uh, because I do get Kindle points, and I will read the second issue, and then I will decide if, um, I will continue with it. So I will see you guys around, and, uh, one more thing, I am reading, uh, I will be reading The Boy Wonder Issue 2 today. I was not going to upload another video, but then I saw this comic, and I'm like, Oh, okay, I'll just go ahead and do one more video, and then later on today, I will do the, I will have, you will have your review of the Boy Wonder issue number two, so I will see you guys then.